welcome back to the Pixart Editing Lab. My name is Mathilde and today I'm going to be breaking down how to use the remove tool and the AI replace to get your pictures looking from this to this. So if you want to learn how to do that, then keep on watching. Okay, so this is the image that I want to use in my store. And as you can see, it's super cluttered in the background, but I really like the lighting. So I'm going to start off by selecting the things that I want to remove using the remove tool. A super useful tip right now is just to overline slightly the things that you want to remove to give it a cleaner look. You can just go over it again as many times as you want until you get the texture or the effect that you wanted. I'm also going to go over in the mug and just remove a few details that is just going to make it look a little bit more sleek for my website. It's a super useful tool as well if you're taking pictures in public and you want to remove people. Over to the AI replace, I'm now going to select the bottom part and I'm actually going to change where the mug's sitting on. I'm going to make it a more clear and professional looking wooden surface. So I'm just going to go ahead and select this perfectly and I'm going to go over on the prompt and just type up what I want it to be. AI replace is going to be super useful and generate some examples for you. If you don't like any of them, just go back and edit your prompt. Make sure to be as specific as you'd like. So for me, this turned out to be perfect and I think it's going to just spice up my store and make it look super professional. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy, make sure to subscribe and turn on the notifications because we're going to be posting so many more of these Pixar editing labs as well as our regular videos every Monday. If you want to be updated on that, also don't forget to follow us on Instagram and TikTok and I will see you next week. Bye!